Hey everyone, Kelly Dean Allen here once again. Today we've got another quick, fun to play and relatively easy one for you, Surrender by Rick Nielsen and Cheap Trick from the band's 1978 album, Heaven Tonight. No solos in this one, just lots of blues progressions and power chords for the most part. So uh, nothing too overly difficult here in order to get through this track from start to finish. Uh, that said, let's get underway, shall we? We are in standard tuning for this tutorial and uh, this one kind of starts off key and with this rather dissonant chord right there. Uh, it's kind of like a G sharp chord here with an A sharp in the bass, just barring the first fret of the A, D, and the G string, right? We're going to strike that eight times or for the first two bars of this track. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then you drop right into an A sharp power chord, give it a little down, up, down, and let that ring for two bars, right? And then you repeat. One, two, three, Repeat. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then we drop into the first verse. Now we're going to drop into the proper key that this song is in, B. And we're, so we're going to drop into a B5 chord here. Power chord basically, two and four of the A and the D. And we're going to bounce off the six with this little blues progression. That kind of deal, right? And we're going to do that for one bar, and then we're going to move it up to F sharp and do the same thing. And then off to E. And when you go off to E, you're just going to chug it. You're not going to play a blues progression, right? F sharp. E. Ba -da -ba -ba. And then you're going to drop back into B, and you're not going to repeat the blues progression. You're going to do that. You're going to go ba -da -ba -ba, that kind of rhythm, right? And then you repeat. Now for the pre-chorus, we're going to kind of reverse that. We're going to go off to E into F sharp and back to B. Just chugging. E, F sharp. Right, and that leads into the chorus. So that is the opening of this track. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Three, four, one, two, three, four. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. drop into the chorus. So for the chorus, we're going to stay in B, but we're going to change the root note as we're progressing through the chorus. So we're going to start with B, and you can kind of take your pinky and drop it down and cover the B string as well. You know, you can make a full uh, B major bar chord here with uh, your uh, ring finger, right? I like to just kind of dip my pinky down and cover the B string. Now you're going to hold that B throughout, but you're going to change the root note. So you're going to start on the root note here on the 2, then you're going to drop your middle finger up here on the 4 of the low E, and then off to the F sharp at the 2nd fret. And then off to E, right? And you're going to repeat that twice. When you're doing these uh, dropping onto the 4 and off to the 2, you're muting the A string with the pad of your middle finger and the pad of your index, right? You don't want to hear that A string. And at the end of the chorus, you just hang in E for 4 bars. Leading back into the second verse, we're going to play what we played at the very beginning of the track, but now we're going to play it in key. We're going to go from A to B. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Grab that B, let it ring for two bars, and repeat. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Three, four, one, two, three, four. Into the second verse. Same as the first. Bum, 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 bum. E, F sharp, 
third verse but we're going to have a key change we're going to move everything up a semitone to C we're going to play the exact same progression but now we're going to go off to F and then back to C right G F C now back to F into G back to C to the five below E off to the three. very short little bridge. So the bridge we're going to go from C to F back to C. Back to C and then up to G and repeat. And back into another course. going to repeat at this point until fade out. And that is how you play Surrender by Cheap Trick and Rick Nielsen. Certainly hope you enjoyed the video, found it helpful. If you did, please hit that like button right down there. Maybe drop me a subscribe if you haven't done that already, as that would be very kind and helpful to the growth of my little channel. Hope you're well out there in your little guitar corner of the world. And uh, for those of you out there in your little guitar corner of the world who support me on Patreon, I just want to say a special thank you to you guys. Uh, really means a lot. I really appreciate it. Helps me get a little bit closer to the goal of doing this for a living. Uh, not quite there yet, but uh, working on it. And hopefully within a year we'll get there, And which is just win-win for everyone. I get to, you know, stay home and make videos all day long and you guys get lots more content. So, uh, you know, I, I post a video per day pretty much at this point, but uh, maybe I'll, I'll up that to two per day. We'll see. Anyway, you guys take care of yourselves. We'll see you next time. Yeah. Cheers.